So a lot of people ask me, you know, what, what do we do at R3 on soybeans? And, uh, you know, one of the cool things about some of these products that we use, we don't have to worry about extra applications. We're standing in our uh, nature's high yield soybean plot, and these beans are actually R3 beans. So R3 beans, if you count down or if you count down four nodes and the pod is three sixteenths or bigger, you call it R3. Well, you, can, you probably can't see this pod right here, but it's probably close to a half inch. So we're a full R3, if not a little bit past R3. We've had a tremendous amount of rains. In the last 12 days, we've been in the field one and a half days. So timing's been a little bit of an issue, but we're still on time on this field. The cool thing about these products is, you know, they piggyback, they have a free ride. And so when we're putting out our, uh, our post chem pass, you know, we're able to put a product in there to uh, just kind of build it up a micronutrient pack. On this R3 application, we're fixing to run a uh, gallon and a half of knockout. We're gonna run a quart of finish line and a pint and a half of a uh, money ball. So those are three nature's products we've done really, really good with. So all those products will be mixed in on this R3 pass which actually will have a herbicide in here too. It won't be nothing major. It'll be just an application of glyphosate to uh, kind of control any grass that might come up in it, you know, or might be some sprigs of grass up or something we missed on our second post chem pass. So free ride, very decent ROI on, on these products. Uh, we all need micronutrients. If you'll treat these soybeans like you treat your corn crop or you treat your cotton crop, pay attention to them, do the things to them. You know, make sure you've got the micronutrients there. You've got drainage, you've got you know, the right varieties and really pay attention to what a soybean crop can do. It can go upwards of 80 bushels pretty easy. So we'll keep you posted on this field all year.